What's up everybody, in this video we are going to overclock AMD Ryzen 5 1600. To overclock you will require these software, download link will be in description. Firstly, download AMD Ryzen Master. Through this software we can easily overclock and monitor our system. Go to their website, scroll down to bottom. Download AMD Ryzen Master for all other Ryzen processors. If you have Threadripper processor then download the other one. Now download Cinebench from Maxim website, for Ryzen benchmarks and stress test. Install AMD Ryzen Master and run it, ignore this warning message. Here you have 4 profile to save different setting. This first page is your current system setting you can't change this setting from here. You need to change everything in custom profiles. I already have some settings in first profile, so I'll change settings in second profile. Here everything will be on this stock speed. Open Cinebench. Now we will increase speed plus 200 MHz till we reach our maximum boost clock. My Ryzen 5 1600 boost clock is 3.6 GHz. This is pattern to increase your speed. After increasing speed, run CPU test in Cinebench and monitor your temperature. OK. Now increase more 200 MHz and again run CPU test and monitor you system. Till now everything is fine, because my processor can easily reach its boost clock without increasing its voltage. Now we will increase 100 MHz also this time we need to increase voltage, because if we provide less voltage then our system is going to unstable and there would be more chance of crash. Through this way you need to increase your voltage. So, increase your voltage 1 times. Again run CPU test and monitor. Again increase 100 MHz, and also increase your voltage 2 times this times. Now increase more 100 MHz, and also increase your voltage 4 time. I have increased it 6 time because of my system just crash on 3.9 GHz. Again run CPU test and monitor. Now we will again increase 100 MHz and voltage 6 times this time. Again run stress test. Ok my system just crashed 4 GHz and I have reached the maximum voltage of 1.33 volt. So, I have fine stable speed of 3900 MHz. But this setting is not permanent, and will change back, if we close AMD Ryzen Master. To make this setting permanent we need to reboot to BIOS and overclock speed, and change voltage from BIOS. I'm overclocking Ryzen on my Gigabyte AB350 gaming, but all the motherboards are almost same you just need to find. If you open BIOS for first time on Gigabyte board you need to switch from easy mode to classic mode. Then go to advanced frequency setting, and change CPU clock ratio from auto to watts your stable speed is. So by clicking page down button you can increase your clock ratio, and by page up you can decrease clock ratio. Then go to MIT. Advanced voltage settings change your DRAM voltage to your stable voltage, which you get in AMD Ryzen Master. Save setting and restart. Now you can see in system properties, that my processor is running at 3.9 GHz. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching. For gaming performance difference and benchmarks watch this video. And share your overclocking experience in comments. And don't forget to subscribe.